Hello, Southwest community. Welcome back to another World Tanks console video. So, in this video, I'm going to be doing like an equipment guide. It's just like I did a commander guide. It's going to be a, an equipment guide. This one's going to be a lot shorter than the equipment uh, commander guide, so because there's not that much to talk about. First of all, um, let's tell you how to put equipment on. So, in the bottom left of your tank, you'll see a button that says customize on PlayStation 4, uh, PlayStation, it's square. So you go to the tank, you want to put equipment out. Make sure you're on the loadout tab and go to the equipment slots. Uh, just click one. There's 15 pieces of equipment in total, depending on what tank you have or what tank you're trying to equip. Some module of uh, some equipment pieces will not be available. All tanks, when you get it, have this one. They have the advanced, the enhanced target info. It will be your fourth equipment slot. So four, you have four equipment slots, and on your fourth one, when you buy the tank, it'll have equipment called enhanced target info. Yeah, this is a piece of equipment that has an outline. When you look at a tank, it has the outline of the tank there, and it shows the penetration. It shows the red, yellow, and green, I think it is, for the red and green color, uh, for the red and green people that have that enabled. Also, this is free. Uh, this is not really. Okay, so when you take it off for the very first time, it is free, it gives you nothing. But when you put it on the tank, it costs 500,000. Well. It will call silver. Also, when you take a piece of equipment off, let's say I'm gonna go ahead and put this camo net on it. That was a hundred thousand silver. And now if I go ahead and remove it, I hit triangle and look at that. Fifty thousand. Just lost fifty thousand silver. Also, what I mean by the yellow thing up here. There's four equipment slots, so when your little yellow marker is over the four equipment slots, that will tell you where you're putting the equipment. Let's say if I want to buy the camo net, and since I have the third slot selected, it will put it in the third slot. Now, what will happen if you have it equipped? Like, you have the camo net equipped in your third slot, and your little yellow thing is right there, and you pro try to buy another piece of equipment. This will happen. I'm just trying to find a cheap one. It will replace it. And you will get half of the silver back. For the camo net. So that's how you do that. That's how you put it in. So I don't know how many people actually knew that. But yeah. So now as you can see on the right side of your screen. It says ammo, equipment, consumables, and camouflage. Right there at the equipment, it shows you your four slots. It shows you what type of equipment you have on your tank. Also, when you put equipment, your viewing, concealment, and time, and accuracy will change on your tank stats. They also do it for the commanders, but I forgot to mention it through that, that video. But it also does it for the equipment. So there is 15 pieces of equipment in total. There is the advanced repair system that basically repairs everything on your tank 25% faster. The spawner, it protects you from ramming and explosive, like ramming damage and high explosive. Uh, advanced opposite is basically gives you 10% view range, which is always nice. Advanced concealment reduces tank detectability. Uh, that's all it says, so I have no idea what else it does. Event suspension. Your tracks durability, your tracks hit points. If you don't know, all your modules have at your hit points. They have your modules have hit points of their own, so when you put the event sus suspension on, it gives your tracks 50% more hit points. Also, Damage environmental collision. I'm guessing that's from like ramming somebody or falling off a cliff or ramming into a rock. You'll get like 
you get less than 50%. Oh, that's kind of cool. That probably takes into like con consideration of fall damage. That's like 50% less fall damage. That's kind of cool. I never knew that. Reinforced fuel tanks. 50% uh, to your fuel tanks so you don't get set on fire that much. Reinforced Amorite. 50% to your Amorite so you don't get Amorite a lot. Advanced Gunling Drive. 12% to your aiming speed. Advanced Loader is 10%, uh, minus 10% to your loading speed. Also, auto letters can, uh, auto letters cannot put this on their tank. Crew vents will improve ventilation. Everything about your tank gets 5% better. Which, for your crew gets 5% better, or your commander. I don't know why it's still called crew, but it should be called commander. Also, if you have an open top turret on your tank, you cannot put this on your tank. It will not have the thing. Engine protection, 50% to your engine. Apparently the only tanks I could find with is Russian tanks have this. I don't understand, but okay. Good stabilizer. Accuracy, it gives you 20% more accuracy. Advanced armor, basically you take 5% less damage of somebody shooting you. Basically, if somebody shoots you for, if it's gonna shoot you for 100 damage, they'll shoot you for 95 damage. Now, it's not a lot, but every bit helps, especially when you combine it with the same thing for the commander, the skill. Also, this is the most, piece, most expensive piece of equipment there is. It usually costs around 800,000, 900,000, a million silver, depending on what tech you pick. And I think you can only put this on heavy tanks. The Advanced Reload. This is a really cool one. It's kind of a cheap one. You can swap non-clip ammo freely. So basically, if you don't have an auto loader or an auto reloader, you can switch your ammo type. You could go from your standard to premium to high explosive and back to your standard or back to your premium or whatever you want to do having without having to reload, which is really cool. And I already talked about the enhanced target info. So that's pretty much about the equipment. There's not that much to talk about. So I guess that's it. <laughs> Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Ultimate is my fish because war is not. And peace out. See ya.